there are different understandings of what amounts to sexual assault. What I experienced was being followed, aggressively propositioned and inappropriately touched. Silence is violence. And yesterday I could not stay silent. As someone who has knowingly made me feel unsafe, had the gall to stand up in front of Parliament and preach about protecting women. This was not an isolated incident, and there are others I could name who have inappropriately touched me, invaded my space and knowingly made me feel unsafe. I am disappointed by the reaction of the Senator. Instead of stepping up, taking accountability for the fact that he made me feel unsafe, he denied it. Uh, since the airing of uh, Senator Thorpe's allegation yesterday, uh, further allegations in relation to Senator Van have been brought to my attention overnight and this morning. As such, I met with Senator Van this morning and a short time ago, I advised Senator Van uh, of my decision that he should no longer sit in the Liberal Party party room. At the outset, I want to make clear, uh, very clear, that I'm not making any judgment on the veracity of allegations or any individual's guilt or innocence. Let me say this in the clearest possible terms. Senator Thorpe's allegations are concocted from beginning to end. Nothing that she has alleged about me is truthful. No such exchange occurred between us. There is no interaction that could conceivably resemble what she described today. Making false allegations in the Senate today is disgraceful and brings the Senate into disrepute. Senator Thorpe's statement today reflects what she disclosed to the Greens leadership two years ago. She was greatly distressed. We backed her and supported her and sought solutions alongside her through discussions with the Senate president at the time, the Liberal Senate leadership and the Prime Minister's office. There should be and must be an investigation into these outrageous claims so they can be proved to be false. I will fully cooperate with investigators and answer any questions that they may have of me, and Senator Thorpe should do the same. 